Olive Oil Spanish Kitchen. My name is Aran, she is Yoko and he is Oli. Today we are going to make bread, but not just a simple one. We are going to make bread filled with chorizo, cheese, black olives, so it's delicious. So if you want to know how to prepare this stuffed bread, stay with us and let's get started with the ingredients. For this recipe we need 300 milliliters of warm water, 7 grams of bakery's yeast, 2 tablespoons of olive oil, 1 tablespoon of honey, 350 grams of strained flour, 150 grams of wool with flour and 30 grams of salt. For the filling I'm going to use rosemary, about 150 grams of chorizo, cherry tomatoes, black olives, 100 grams of goat cheese and 125 grams of mozzarella. First we will put the yeast in the warm water. The water should be about 35-37 degrees. Stir very well with a spoon and let it rest for about 5 minutes until bubbles start to appear on the surface. Put the flour and the salt in the bowl of the mixer and add the honey, the olive oil and the mixture of the water with the yeast. Leave kneading until you get an elastic dot that does not stick to your hands. Make a bowl and let it rest covered with a cloth for one hour. While we are going to prepare the filling, wash and cut the tomatoes in half. Cut the olives into slices. Cut the chorizo into slices. I recommend you to peel it first. Chop the rosemary, and chop the cheese. I have used a buffalo mozzarella because I had it in the fridge, but you can use normal mozzarella. Sprinkle a little flour on the kitchen counter and stretch the dough with your hands. Spread the ingredients over the entire surface, leaving about 3-4 cm border. Brush the egg with water and make a roll with the dough, taking care that the ingredients don't come out and seal it very well by pinching the edges of the dough with your fingers. Put it in a baking dish covered with baking paper and cover with plastic wrap. Let it rest about 30 minutes. Preheat the oven to 250 degrees. Once it has settled, remove the film and bake it for about 40 minutes at 200 degrees. And it's ready guys! Oof, you can't imagine how this smells. I'm going to cut it so you can see it inside. And as you can imagine, you can fill it with whatever you want with ham, curry cheese, spinach, pesto, peppers. Mmm, it's delicious. Warm and freshly made is the best way to eat it. The following days, when it will be cold and little drier, 
it's perfect to cut it into thin slices and have it for breakfast so guys i hope you like it so much this recipe and we will see you very soon in the next video bye bye